Hey guys, or hello internet. Um, today I have a new time lapse for you guys. Today, if you couldn't tell by the beginning, because I'm pretty sure hello internet kind of gave it away a little bit, probably not because I don't have a British accent. No, still not getting it. Wow. Just wow. Um, considering I have no subscribers, probably. That's probably the reason why. Um, but anyway, today I have a new time lapse. It is of Charmander. Uh, it's the pixel version um this was inspired by amazing phil because he wears a t-shirt in some of his videos of um this charmander here literally this picture um i had to actually search a t-shirt like the charmander pixel t-shirt and then it came up with um t-shirts and then it was him front facing because i couldn't find any pictures of him like that um then I searched up Phil, um, Phil Charmander t-shirt or whatever, and it, I finally found one, and it was, it was good. Um, so I found, found this one, and, um, yeah. Um, so this was most definitely inspired by, um, Amazing Phil. But anyway, so I'm, I cut out the background, or the, um, what's it called, border, the pixel border, um, it did take me a couple times to do this, but I cut that part out so you guys can just see this part. Um, and what else? Oh yeah, with pixels, since they are completely straight lines, you have to be very, very precise and careful with it. Um, because if you don't get it precise and careful, you will be able to tell the difference between what is straight and what is crooked or curved or made a zigzag or whatever. Um, so just be aware of that. Make sure you are nice. Take your time slow. This is sped up, so obviously I didn't take my time, um, through the video. I did take a lot, a lot of time doing this one. It took me an hour, whereas these normally take me a half an hour. This one took me a whole hour because I tried to make it as perfect as I could because I... I love Amazing Phil, and I love Dan is Not on Fire, and I just wanted to make this look perfect, because I'm hoping they would see this. I really want them to see this, because this is awesome, and it's my favorite one so far. Besides my Pikachu, this one is one of my absolute favorites, like my first or second favorite. I love this one so much. I took so much time, so much effort, um, yeah. Um, but anyway, <laughs> enough about that. Um, yeah, so now I'm doing the orange part of it. Um, the orange part actually had, like, a few different colors, like a lighter part and then a darker part, and it was just, like, different pixels. But, um, yeah, sorry, I dozed off there for a second. Um, but I don't have those colors because they don't have them in, um, duct tape. Um, so I just stuck with a plain orange brand color or whatever. Um, yeah, and if you can't already tell, ugh, if you can't already tell, I have a bunch of band-aids on my arm, uh, not my arm, my hand. That is because I am accident prone and I really hurt my arm a lot over the past couple of days. Yeah, it took me a couple times to do this part, actually. I had to actually, I ended up cutting it, um, cutting the small part off, um, and then sticking on um yeah um so this is just a basically a bunch of different layers on layers um not too many layers though i mean it was fine um but yeah here i am cutting out the blue parts um i'm actually freehanding most of these um technically freehanding technically not um, okay, so I messed up on the eyes because I put them the wrong way. Like, they flopped, or flipped, <laughs> flopped, they flipped, um, so that's why I had to, I had to relook at the image, because my image was all cut up, so, and I had my image on my computer, so I had to, um, so I had to look at that, and, um, make sure that I was right. Like, here, see, I'm flipping it a different way, um, yeah, and... The re normally I do the eyes last, but 
I felt like <laughs> without the eyes, it was like the the orange on the black was just like staring into my soul. It was so creepy. I don't know. I'm weird. But um, yeah. It took me an hour to do. I hope you really like it. Um, hope Amazing Phil and Dana's not on fire. I totally see this. That would be a dream come true. That'd be awesome. I just, oh my god. I'm probably going to tweet this to them. They're probably not going to see it though. Um, hopefully they will though. They're good people, I think. I think. Hopefully. Um, yeah. Okay, so now I'm doing the uh, fire on his tail. Um, I absolutely love Pokemon a lot. I'm actually, um, after I'm done editing and all of this shiznick, I'm going downstairs to play some Poke Park 2 with my sister on the Wii. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. No, I'm not really. <laughs> but I'm, I'm probably going to have a fun time playing the game. Okay, so there's my signature. Um, and this was inspired by at Amazing Phil. But I had to cross out a couple things because I messed up before. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, so, yeah, here it is. I'm very, very proud. Um, I hope you like it. Um, don't forget to check out my other videos. Subscribe, like, favorite, share, all of that. And I hope you guys, hopefully, like, well, probably no one's watching. But if you tweet this to them, that would be awesome. Hopefully sometime they will see it. Um, yeah. Um, so, like I was saying before, it was inspired by Ad Amazing Phil. This is in slow motion, yes. Um, thank you for watching, and goodbye.